Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. Just got back from a card show, Newark, Newark California uh, card show. There was a handful of tables, I mean, maybe 40, 30 people, uh, I mean tables. Uh, crowd, not so crowded, which is definitely what I like. I think I got there between 11 or 12 a.m. on Sunday, August 13th. And these are my pickups here. I actually wanted to buy some um, some wax, but uh, nobody was selling wax that I was interested in. A lot of new shit. Like, I, I like older stuff, but, you know, it is what it is. So these are three different areas, the tables that I visited, one, two, three, or purchased from, one, two, three. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over the price and, uh, you know, let me know what you think. But uh, a lot of graded cards I picked up. I had a handful of singles up here. And I'll tell you the prices. So these first, first five are going to be $5 each. I have a James Wiseman uh, Gem 10 for 5 bucks. Uh, Ronaldo, uh, 8.5 CSG. I don't have a lot of soccer. Uh, after today, I have a lot more <laughs> or a bit more. Um, I know it's not the best card, but you know, five bucks for a graded card, and I, I like CSG, so I'm okay with that. Um, James Wiseman, another one from the same 2020 Prism draft pick. Um, it's gem 10 for five bucks. And then I got this bad boy, this Mason Greenwood Rising Star uh, from Topps Attacks. I think this might be his rookie, not 100% sure, but it's a gem 10 with CSG. Pretty cool. Uh, last card was actually twenty five dollars. It's a, uh, it's an optic, mint nine, uh, Kylian Mbappe rookie card for twenty five dollars. So, um, yeah, forty five bucks for these cards. Uh, you know, even if I overpaid for this, I feel like I, I did well as a package deal. So these are the cards. The Mbappe I really liked, and twenty five bucks for an optic. I I thought it was a good deal. Um, I'm happy with it at least. Yeah, that's a lot of soccer. <laughs> All right. Next is going to be, I forgot to put these in order, but I did buy this James Wiseman. I think he, he gave it to me for 20 bucks. And um, I know it's more than what I paid for those, but uh, I, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I feel like they got the coach, uh, Monty Williams from Phoenix. He's an athletic big and left-handed. I feel like Detroit could build something um, so long as the kids are coachable, right? So, so long as Wiseman stays healthy and is coachable, they should do okay. So that was like $25 or 20 or 25 for that. The rest of these cards were a dollar each. Um, so this was a CJ Stroud rookie. I uh, thought it was pretty, I don't have any, a lot of new stuff. So this is pretty cool for me from 2023. CJ Stroud rookie. This Lewis Hamilton refractor. And I don't know anything about racing. I just know that he's, you know, popular. So this is a refractor of Lewis Hamilton for one dollar. Uh, Star Wars cards. This just looked cool. <laughs> so I was like, oh, that looks neat from Star Wars Galaxy. Um, you know, looks nice. Uh, and then this one with C-3PO as a refractor as well. And it was only a dollar. So, you yeah, know, pretty nice. Uh, I got this Jude Bellingham uh, Topps Chrome Bund as Liga, Liga uh, Refractor. Uh, and lastly is a Lionel Messi uh, Topps Chrome. I thought this was a nice looking card there. And this was, I think this was actually $4. So right now we're at five, $9 plus yeah, so 34 plus this card I got for actually $20. I think it's a pretty okay deal. He wanted 25 I asked him if he'd take $20. Um, overall, he dropped the prices of everything just to kind of make it better for me. But this is an ultra rare. I had a Larry Bird, and I sold it for more than I was expecting. So I'm thinking if I sell this at some point, if I sell it, because I really like the way it looks. So there you go, Star Quest, Kobe Bryant. It's a really nice card. I, I, I like it a lot. Some singles. All right, and then this guy, all of this stuff was half off, which I thought was really great. So, um, I don't know if these are in any kind. Okay, 
So they, they, I think he has some color in the back. Okay, so those are, okay, so all of these were $1, but they were half off. So 50 cents each for this, this Justin Jefferson from Luminance. It's a vestige um, insert. And then I got this uh, Keenan Allen number to 100 for 50 cents. Pretty good deal. This is a nice looking uh, Griffey. I thought it was in pretty good shape. Member's choice from 91, 92. Uh, Wayne Gretzky, member's choice as well. Good condition, same same year. Uh, Bailey Zapp, rookie card. I don't have any of his rookies, so now I do. Um, 50 cents for Trevor Lawrence. I'll probably, most of, a lot of these cards I'm gonna sell anyway on my auction site or my eBay. Um, but for now I wanna, because I have duplicates of some of these but I want to keep the better condition. <laughs> so Shea Gildress Alexander, rookie card, Amperny, Simon's rookie card. This is a cool looking uh, Gretzky from 90. Uh, Joe Burrow, Catalyst, uh, Cat Cat Catapults, is that what it is? Catapults. That was a nice looking card. I figured somebody else, you know, saw it online. Derek Brooks, I think he's a Hall of Famer. I, I'm fairly certain he's a Hall of Famer, so I got his rookie card here, 50 cents. Desmond Bain rookie. Luca Base, Anthony Edwards rookie, and a Ricky Pierce autograph for 50 cents. It's a prism auto. Ricky Pierce, you know? It was good. And then these were half off. Um, so these were $2.50. Lewis Hamilton, purple. Uh, it's $2.50 for that. Uh, Baron Davis, patch card, $2.50. Pretty nice. This looked really cool. So you have Patrick Ewing, Nate the Great, and David Lee. You know, pretty nice. And I think David Lee won, I don't know that he played much, but I thought he won a ring with the uh, Warriors. Patrick Ewing has no rings. Nate Robinson was in the ring and then got knocked out by Jake Paul. So it all ties in together, you see. Uh, next up is this uh, uh, Andre Iguodala, number to 99. Um, probably shouldn't have bought it. Uh, I just like Iggy. He's awesome. Uh, Kenny Pickett, rookie from Origins. Um, I opened a pack of football and I got uh, Kenny Pickens patch and then a rookie. So I guess he's now my favorite player in the entire world. <laughs> but that was $2.50. And then this Desmond Ritter. Going to see how he plays out. This is, I, I like this card. It's a thick card stock. Um, about $2.50. Uh, figure that you can't go wrong with that. Well, I can go wrong, but let's just hope I don't. Next up are going to be $10 slabs marked down to $5. Trey Young, PSA 9, rookie. 90 Marvel Universe. So I collect the only this particular, um, the MVC, the Most Valuable Comics. I would like to put them in a CGC grade so that they match the comic. Uh, I just thought it would look cool. So this is a nine, so I, I mean, it's probably worth more than the ones that I have. And I do like this set a lot. So I do have a complete set, and I, I am trying to work on the full run uh, graded. Uh, Nightcrawler, five bucks. Nice Kobe Bryant here with, uh, it's a CSG nine. He wanted 20, but he, uh, it happened to be in the wrong section. And so he gave it to me for five. I told him I'd, I'd pay 10, or I, I wouldn't pay 10 for it because I, I don't want it that bad. But for five bucks, I figured that's a good deal. Oh, you suck. Um, next up. Uh, this Peyton Manning was only five bucks. Uh, early Peyton Manning, 2000 Skybox Skylines. Back of that. Uh, another insert, Fleer Focus, Toast of the Town. And again, this is 2001, so third year. Uh, 8.5, I know it's low grade, but not a bad deal. This looked kind of cool. It's a 7.5, but it's a Shaquille O'Neal Metal Universe. It just looked nice. Now we're getting into the more expensive stuff. These are $20 marked down to 10. So Ray Allen, rookie, PSA 9. I'm not sure if I have it already um, I, as far as my Hall of Fame collection goes. If I do, then I'm selling this. But uh, if I don't, then I have a 9. So I'm happy with that. This looked cool. This was um, 10 bucks. Uh, record breaker from Topps Chrome, Peyton Manning, 2003. There's the back of that bad boy. Um, 
what was this? Okay, so this is a Zach Wilson 9.5, which is a good grade. Yeah, five bucks. And these were, I think, a little more expensive. So this is an Anthony Edwards, uh, $9 for this one. But it's a 9.5 rookie. I thought that was a good deal. And lastly, this is the, my most expensive card. I paid $40 for this Phil Foden uh, Gem 10 Donruss rookie. He wanted 50, but he gave it to me for 40. I thought it was a decent deal. So we'll see if he keeps playing well, then good for this card. But it's it, it's a Donruss. I don't think they go up too much uh, in value um, compared to the optic or whatever. So anyway, that those are my pickups from today. Uh, let me know what you think, uh, if you have any thoughts. Uh, don't tell me I got ripped off. Please don't tell me that. Oh, man. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, like and subscribe. Yay. All right. See you next time. Bye.